Hi, this is Shane, and welcome back to another episode of Cuboid Outpost. And, um, I have been, I know I was saying I was going to do a whole set of stuff in between episodes. Um, well, I did this. I made most of the, the bits that they wanted. However, haven't got the puffer fish. I made the marine fisher because you can, I think you can get it from the marine fisher. I don't know. I made that, but that doesn't seem to be making anything, which is a bit random. Um, I did do all the spawn eggs though, which was quite cool. Basically, you had to um, get a bucket of witch water, bucket of lactic acid, which is milk a bucket and salt and a bucket of bucket of seawater which is um which water no not which water sand sand with a barrel of water on top and that turns it into seawater and you make spawn eggs like we did with uh the other spawn eggs the pigeon not pigeons <laughs> um chickens and the other stuff so i did all i did all of them if you do a minimum of five, you get something special. You could get one of these random rewards. And I got an obsidian skull. And the obsidian skull gives me immunity to burning and 50% resistance to fire damage. I haven't, um, haven't tried it out yet, but there's that. Um, I tried making, let me see. Oh. I made this behind here so I could access all the bits and pieces. Tried hooking up the rainbow furnace. I think that might be sided because it's it's not looking at... It wasn't working, so I just left it and I use it manually when I need to. So now we have this access point behind here. And upstairs... What else did I make? I put in this extra door because... I went and added extra drawers here. I did some framed drawers um, big in anticipation for the mob farm and having stuff come out of the mob farm. But no door, no door to get through because at the time, actually, is that? Oh, yeah, nothing can spawn behind here. Cool. At the time that I did it, there was still a big gap in the wall. And, um, but I went and did all of that just, um, for when I have to hook it all up to the system. And if we go round, I did framed drawers because that was one of the, um, one of the quests to do, to do frames. And then you can put the frames, let me see, hold on one second. Frame, ah, uh, would help you spell, ch spell properly. Frame, frame, frame. Right. So you have sticks around one of the types of drawers. Yeah, that's missing a compacting drawer. But if I wanted, like, I have framed trim, which is slightly different. But you put sticks around the drawer. And then once you have the drawer, you put the drawer down here in this bottom corner and put the blocks that you wanted to cover it with here and you could use three different blocks so i could have had for, for example let's just make uh not the trim because the trim is different frame draw is that one point that's a normal one yeah so if we do that and then get three different blocks so um say granite um i don't know sand and blackstone i don't know if this random combination is going to work but you would put it round and the frame draw and it would give you a draw as sand on the front granite on the sides and a trim of frame blackstone or not frame black or blackstone and then if we put it in the wall, just to see what it looks like. Bit of a lighting glitch, but that's what it looks like, basically. So you can have, you know, custom drawers and stuff, and it acts just like 
any other drawer so you can lock it and everything else and you can see what's in it all of that stuff so there's that so i made um i made some framed drawers i made a slave controller a draw, draw controller sorry i did trim to connect the controller to the drawers so some of this is trim and some of this is actual not so goodium ore but because you know I've, I've, I've put the cover on it you can't tell the difference and the trim I discovered is made slightly differently trim so if I make frame trim and you put it down instead of putting it round in a three you'd put it in a two so let's say cobblestone and I don't know a diamond all right let's do that there again I don't know if that's actually going to work but let's see So the trim now has cobble around the outside and a diamond trim. But actually that those are pretty good as decorative blocks go. I kind of like that. Yeah, but that's what you can do. So I did trim because, it, like I said, it was one of the quests. Um, the mob farm. I know that I said I had all these plans. I was going to put it outside. And then I thought, actually, I've got the space here. It's already set up. So I I don't I don't think it's getting any mob drops. I put in the mob slaughter factory. It has power going to it. And I've set up um two black hole, simple black hole tanks. And they hold, I think, a million buckets or something. No, that can't be right. They hold loads. Why do I think a million? I don't know why I think a million. Simple. That's right. Simple black hole unit. No. Black, yeah, a million buckets. Yeah, because I didn't want the smaller ones because I didn't want to get them overwhelmed. But because I don't have mob du duplicators, it's producing mobs very, very slowly. And there's no light in there. Unless there's light coming in through here. I don't know. I don't think so. Unless the ender... Let me try taking out the ender hopper. Uh, let's put a... I oh know, light comes through slabs, doesn't it? Uh, let's turn on... There you go. Um, what blocks can we put there? Because we don't want anything to... Oh, we can put glass. No, but glass will let light, light through. Do we have dark glass? I think we do. Dark glass, yes. Blocks light. Because we don't want anything to spawn on there because the working area is in front and not behind. Ah, stupid free runners. There you go. So, oh no, but nothing would... Eh, it doesn't matter. Right, so that's there. This thing's going into it slowly because we have a whole four buckets of liquid meat. Oh yeah, a thousand killer buckets. Yeah. But we don't have, we don't have a lot of pink slime. So it's going up really, really slowly. Um, anything else that I did? Uh, da, 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 da. I don't think so. Slaughterhouse, pack your bags, nothing else. I'm sure there was something else. Okay. I'm sure there was something else that I worked on. Moving items? Oh, I did some of these. Oh, I can do the transporters as well. I did them, the, the pipes, the mechanical pipes in... I was moving items, fluid transfer. Oh, I did most most of fluid transfer or a finished fluid transfer i finished it yes i did gas transfer ages ago energy i haven't really looked at and moving items i haven't done much with 
that those were the other things. So basically, I'm waiting for this bucket of pink slime. Is there something? No. I'm waiting for the bucket of pink slime, which is taking forever. Or maybe I could drop some um some mobs in there. Hmm. Because you need the mob imprisonment tool. Let's have a look. Um, where are we? Not dirtying the dishes. Utterly delicious. Or maybe we can work on that one. I don't know. Yeah, so I'm waiting for the, the pink slime. And everything leads everything leads to the advanced machine frame. Because this you can't do you can't do the duplicating mods until you do I think I'm a clone now which is here and that comes from the advanced machine frame so everything is waiting on this so while oh I did start to do the um I was about to do the purple laser lens because at least I can do that while I'm waiting did I yes dissolution chamber you need four glass panes they said a white lens but i wonder if i could do it with purple as well no hold on oh there's no latex in there we get a bucket of latex okay, if we put purple oh you can do it straight hmm that's interesting because that recipe does not show up in jei if you look up lens and if you do purple it will tell you or does it oh there's just me being being blind and not noticing that because i saw this and didn't notice these which is a bit bizarre but yeah so we have a purple laser lens we don't have the wither gas because we can't make the wither ether gas not wither gas because again we need the advanced machine frame and we need the pink slime so we can do something different and what was i going to do and i cannot remember we can do some cooking maybe mm, i don't feel like cooking um utterly delicious we could do this one because we've done half of it already okay so you get a book for that a cookbook you got Cook that, which I'm pretty sure I did. Let's see what's here. Yep, I knew I had a version already. So there's that. We get two crafting tables. And then cooking for blockheads part two. Uh, that one. Uh, the heart of the kitchen, which is the cooking table. So let's head upstairs. First of all, let's just empty out our inventory. The laser drills can go in uh do all of that other than that i don't think there was anything else that i did it's all pretty much just doing stuff cooking table is this one and we've got that back the only thing is when you pick it up you lose the dye so we have to re-dye it yellow which i thought i oh no maybe it's in the other one yeah yep it's in this one let's just keep up Keep a handful of this um then a vertical the sink what's that oh the hanging corner okay so i want a cupboard which we have um i'm pretty sure one of the cabinets anything else uh the filler counter and the corner and the sink and just the, the hanging count hanging kitchen corner and the counter corner okay all right if we put in corner let's see what comes up corner so that is we're missing terracotta all right let's go downstairs put it in the maybe we should have a rainbow furnace up here actually uh furnace rainbow core I thought I had a rainbow furnace, an extra rainbow furnace. It's a bit out of place, but you know, adds a bit of sparkle to the kitchen. And we need some coal for that too. 
but I'm pretty sure. I wonder how long one one thing of coal would last. Um, all right, don't do that. Okay, all right. So let's put you here and let's go back to our corners. Corner. All right. So our kitchen corner and our hanging kitchen corner. Uh, connect all together so we need a kitchen floor that's concrete and white concrete block of coal block of quartz I mean we only just want it for this black concrete pretty sure we have black concrete concrete yep and we need white concrete Is that white yes how do you make a white concrete powder which is that and then all I did was just stick it under some water. Right, because I'm pretty sure we only need two. Ah. Kitchen floor. All right, we wanted black and white, grey. Kitchen floor. This one. All right, so that's done, and we get some ink sacks. That's wonderful. And we need a fridge, and you get back a fridge. Has this got something in it? Yes, it does. Can we have another fridge? Oh, sure we had another fridge. Yes. And you get back a fridge. Okay, that's cool. Um, right, that is ice unit. I made that. Preservation chamber. Made that. Can I take these out without? Um, I don't think I can take out the upgrades without doing the fridge. All right. There's going to be lots of stuff all over the floor. All right, let's does that have any no, no upgrades. All right, let's put you in. The other fridge is there. Okay. And let's put the stuff back in. There's our two upgrades. Uh, multi block, go in. No, nope, not the configurator. Uh, anything else? Nope. Let's put this all in as well. Yeah, I should have done this when I was actually setting up the kitchen and I didn't think about it. You know, like in hindsight, you think, yeah, should have done, you know, insert thing here. But that's the thing I should have done. Uh, have we got everything? I thought this fridge was full. All right, let's turn on the magnet. Uh, well, we forgot those. I... And a piece of cod. Don't think there was anything else. Mm, no. Okay. Maybe the fridge wasn't full. I thought it was. All right, let's re-dye the fridge. And let's put back in the upgrades. All right, and we get, oh, we get back a preservation chamber. Put that in the little fridge. Uh, what else do we need to do? The oven. And again, I made the upgrade for that. Ah, didn't mean to do that. We're going to be in this. All right, let me see. Now we want that. 
We want those. I want the external storage, the oven. And we want that. Anything else? The heating unit. And the bakeware. That's it, right? So, nope. Can we use, can we use this to turn it around? Or the crescent wrench? Right, let's use this one first. Oh, there you go. Awesome. Put the oven on top. Put, you don't, you don't shift click in. Okay. Saucepan. Pot. Skillet. Bakeware, heating unit, and are you heating up? Yes. And power source. That's that. Is it raining again? Yes, it's raining again. All right. And now they want a spice rack, toaster, bottled milk, fruits, and tool rack. Right, we can do those. Oh, and you get the um, you get the milk in a jar. That's usually fun. All right, so tool rack, a uh, spice rack. We want a jar, a milk jar. We need the. We need a thing of milk, bucket of milk. So you get all the technical terms. A thing of milk. That's what everybody calls it. Where are we over? Where did I make it? Over here? Over here. That's where everything is. A milk jar. Um, can we? We need the assembler, disassembler. To get the toaster. Which has gone into my backpack. Turn off the magnet because we don't need it anymore. And what was the last thing? A fruit tray thing. Turn off caps lock. Fruit. There it is. Fruit basket. And a cow in a jar. You, to get the cow, get a cow to stand on top of a milk jar and then place the anvil above the cow. Uh, uh, above the cow. Right. So, this is the fun bit. Now, we need the mob imprisonment tool, which we have. So, if we get a cow, which one of you lovely people, which one of you lovely cows is going to be you are? You're going to be our delightful assistant for our cow in a jar experiment. We need to go downstairs and we need to get the anvil. Uh, did I use the anvil? Nope. Here's our anvil. And let's go back upstairs. So, we need... We need that. So we need the jar. Actually, let's put it two down. Jar. You need um, a cow. Then you need a block. Uh, do I have a block? Yes, block here. And then you put the anvil against it. And it drops it in. Which I just find absolutely hilarious. And it will, um... It will start making milk. If I put it on one of the countertops, we'll get milk in our recipes. But if we go here to the cooking table... And put in milk. Not enough ingredients. Okay. Is it not full yet? That might be it. Because there's not a bucket of milk. But once there's a bucket of milk. We will get milk to put in our ingredients. In our recipes. So all of this is done. That is done. And the burger bar. Now you've got your kitchen sorted out. Making some nice meals should be easy. Let's try and make some different burgers, both for satisfying hunger. And, okay. 
basic hamburger. Right, let's make a basic burger. Do I have any beef in there? I don't... Do I? I think I do. I hear you. Yes. Right, so you go to the cooking table. If I put burger... Not enough ingredients. What do I need to make the burger? Bread. Salad dressing. Or soy sauce. What are we missing? Everything. Ground beef. The grinder. Why is it saying not enough? Alright, let's break it down. Ground. Ground beef we have. What else? Ketchup? Do we have tomatoes? Not enough ingredients. Alright, are we missing tomatoes? I wish it would tell you what it is missing. But at least then you can, you know, at least make it. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, what are we missing now? bread we can make that brown brief we can make that ketchup we can make that uh, oyster hosin salad soy mayonnaise barbecue hot ketchup okay let's do it this side ketchup oh you can't put it back in okay and bread is there and we make the burger now why does it keep telling me not enough skillet skillet's there right yes all right let's take these out individually so there's the bread there's the ketchup Ground beef. Alright, we got ground beef. And skillet. Let's make it over here instead. I don't know why it kept telling me not enough. Uh, ground beef. Ketchup. Skillet and bread basic burger oh did i not check it there you go and we get back basic burgers and then we have all these different burgers and then we get a delighted meal all right let's see how much of these we could make so hopefully if we put in burger jalapeno burger that's interesting right so what do we need to make Bacon mushroom burger. I don't know if we have any mushrooms in there. Yes, we do. Bacon. Oh, we have no pork. Well, that's a pain. All right, let's go kill a couple of pigs then. Where's, I've got my, my disassembler. All right enough pork for now probably should have turned on my um 16 that's plenty yeah and i probably should have slept but never mind oh i hate it when the doors do that pick you off And replace you. All right. Um, put you in the. There's room in this fridge, right? Ground beef, pork, tallow. I don't think you need that. All right. What was it? Bacon mushroom. Bacon. 
eggs and bacon, bacon wrapped cherry, bacon, uh, good grief, bacon mushroom burger, there's a bacon cheeseburger, we need ketchup and cheese, okay, oh you know what, probably because the skillet was in there, put back the skillet, try that again, Bacon, hmm, interesting, mushroom, but there's white mushrooms, or are they not in the thing? <sighs> no, could be that they're not in here, uh, mushroom, well, mushroom, roasted mushroom. Bacon and eggs. So why does it not want to cook it in this? Unless they want... Alright, let's have a look. Bacon. Missing the sauce and the skillet. Alright, so we know we got ketchup. And we got the skillet. It shouldn't be this hard, to be honest. Bacon. Ah, cheese. How do you make cheese? That is bacon cheeseburger. Bacon mushroom. Right. Yeah, uh, skillet. Back here. Alright. I am going to do the rest of these off camera. Because obviously it's going to sit there and tell me I haven't got a bunch of stuff when I have a bunch of stuff. Do we get something back? We get loads of them back. Deluxe cheeseburger? Yeah, I'm gonna make these off camera and I will be back. Ooh, chicken, basic chicken sandwich. Are we gonna tell me the same thing? So yeah, let me make these off camera. I will be back when I have all of them. Okay, I have just finished making all of the stuff. So it was the, uh, made the bacon mushroom and I think one of the cheeseburgers or something I can't remember but I made all of them so just collect the rewards we get lots and lots of burgers sounds good to me and then the delighted meal which is a McPam fries a soda and the cutting board all right so can we make fries not enough ingredients that is getting on my nerves. Uh, to make fries, what do we need? Salt, potato, pot, and oil. Okay. Oil, potato. All right, do we not have normal potatoes? Doesn't look like it. Potatoes. Get a stack of those. Put them in there. Can we make fries now? No. Why can't we make fries? Salt. We might not have salt. Mm, we have that salt, but I suspect it's not the same. So let's go over here. The help I could spell. Uh, can we fit? No, isn't that salt there? No, that's flour. Salt, let's put you in here. Now can we see everything? You know what? I wonder if it's because they're all external storage maybe because I should I should be able to make all of it we've determined that we have all the ingredients could be because it's all on external storage rather than on the kitchen counters I don't know I really don't know so fries let's try doing it this way delighted meal the, the chopping board and some kind of soda. There's the soda. Okay. Delighted me. What's that? Oh, Turkish delight. Oh, I love Turkish delight. I mean, in real life, I love Turkish delight. There's a delighted meal. And we get four to eight of those. All right. Why didn't we get the bingy sound? Didn't we finish all of it? Oh, no. 
cured beef. All right, beef, vinegar, and salt. What are we missing? Vinegar. And vinegar is glass bottle and an apple in the transmutation thing. Cured beef and beef biltong, which I'm guessing we got to put it in the drying rack. If I'd known, I would have just stayed downstairs. The pity you can't you can't um upgrade it. There you go. And just before we go, let's see, do we have enough for a bucket of Nope. A little bit more pink slime, but not much. I'm going to have to drop some I'm gonna to have to drop some mobs in there offline because that is just taking forever but we did cook so that was that was pretty cool we got some food so instead of making our mob farm we just made lots of burgers sounds like fun to me so thanks very much for watching please like comment and subscribe it really helps to grow my channel and i will see you guys in the next episode Bye bye